Cynthia says, I have been diagnosed with primary progressive MS since 1999. My baseline has continued to worsen over time. I am at 52, and after all the MRIs, I still have no lesions. I was just wondering if this was normal. And then, what is causing the problem without the lesions? Cynthia, you're certainly asking a very good question. And one of the biggest questions that you're really asking is, what is primary progressive MS, and how do we make the diagnosis of it? It is unusual to have primary progressive MS without any changes on your MRI. And I'm not sure if you're referring to just MRI of your brain, but also the MRI of the spinal cord. If, it, if your course of primary progressive MS has been unusual in any way, for example, by having normal imaging, it may be time to go back to your physician and say, do we need to readdress the question of what's causing my changes?